Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions, and thank you again so much for our time together. We're looking forward to seeing you at the services tonight and all day tomorrow as we celebrate Mother's Day and begin to understand Paul's early days at the church in Corinth. It's going to be a great study. But right now, let's go back to the book of Proverbs, chapter 23, verse 17. Listen to the wisdom of this father teaching this son. Do not let your heart envy sinners, but always be zealous for the fear of the Lord. There is surely a hope for you, and your hope will not be cut off. Sometimes when you're going through difficulties and you look around and you see people who don't live right doing so well, Solomon had been taught this by his own father, but that's another study. But you look around and you see the unsaved doing so well, and you see people living in adultery and double families and getting drunk and womanizing and gambling and you see them doing so well, and here you are just trying to serve God. And you look around, and if you're not careful, your heart begins to envy sinners. But Solomon teaches his son, don't ever do that. Don't ever envy. Control your heart. Control your heart. Control your heart. Do not ever envy a sinner. But instead, control your heart. Be zealous for the fear of God. Not taqod but respect. Always be zealous to have respect for God in your life. I don't care if there's no respect that anybody else around you has for God. In your own heart, control your heart. Determine, I will never allow my heart to envy the prosperity of the wicked. I will never allow my heart to envy the life of sinners. Instead, I will always focus my heart on respecting God. Why? He said, for there is a future hope for you. There is no future hope for the sinner. There is a future hope for you, and your hope will not be cut off. Right now, it looks like the wicked are doing better than the righteous, but in the end, the righteous always prosper.